Hey everybody, I am here at Costco. Everybody's favorite place to shop if you're a member. Don't forget, if you have a car, you can get nitrogen in your tires. It's completely free and self-service and it works great. And it's something that you can combine with air, but it's nice that it's there and you don't have to have one of the people in the tire center do it for you. So let's go ahead into Costco to get a few things. So now that the winter is here and it's cold, the Presto heat dish is something I highly recommend. I have the Presto heat dish. I have it for so many years. My model doesn't even adjust. So these newer ones, you can see you can adjust the angle. Now I've heard some people say they're not as hot as the older version, but man, this feels so good standing right here. And as far as electricity bill, by the way, and I'll have to look this next month as I use it to keep myself warm. Uh, I don't remember that I had an issue as far as my electricity bill, but if you are thinking about getting one, it's a great investment and you'll feel so cozy. You're sitting on the couch, put that on you and I feel so, so good. Well, Christmas is in full effect now since Thanksgiving is right around the corner. So you want to get your holiday spirit on. Check out these awesome different holiday items that you can decorate your home with, your apartment with. And instead of buying a tree, you can get yourself one of these fake trees and just keep using it every year. So nice options to go with. You got the uh, little Christmas holiday balls. Oh boy, look at these, these are pretty huge. Let's see what the price on those are. $19.99. There you go. Here's a nice gift for the holiday. Look at this. A luxurious spa quality towel warmer. And it's selling for $84.99. Ooh, that might be nice when you get a shower and warm yourself up. There you go. Nice idea. If you're a Lego fan, look at this. You got a backpack Lego. And then you also can get a hard case. Kind of pricey though. It's $99.99. This is up there. $99.99. And also comes in the blue if you're not interested in red. So, another nice idea if you got somebody who loves Lego and travels. All right, it's not too busy at this time of day, which is good. So, one of the things I do get are the avocados, $7.59 currently. So a lot of these are hard. So I find what I do is I put them on the counter for a day or two and then they soften up and then put them in the refrigerator and you'll get more use out of them. So I definitely could make them last because otherwise they can soft really quick and spoil. So my tip of the day. So recently I got these mangoes and I really like this one. So these are $13.99. And then you also have the Kirkland brand, which they didn't have last time with $18.99. Those are a good way to go. They do have a, a bit of sugar in them, so you just, you know, don't want to overdo it. And they, uh, but they are good as well. So you got the blueberries, dates, you got pineapple chips. Ooh, that might be good. And those have, ooh, a lot of sugar, 16 grams of sugar. Holy cow. So I know it's probably a healthier snack, but still, that's a lot of sugar. All right, we got the organic blueberries here, which I think I'll go with, and you got the regular ones. These look like these are the organic ones. And for a dollar more, or a dollar more, yeah, I think I'll go with the organic ones. Oh, and look at these strawberries. Holy cow, they're pretty big, these, in there. Moving right along. The other thing that I also get while I'm here is the, I get the spring mix and here we go. Great. Not, it doesn't expire to the 25th, so I'll get some use out of that. It generally stays fresh in the container most of the time I find. And then the other thing that I also get, which I think I'm due is some fresh celery. I didn't eat my other celery quick enough. So this is good to the 27th. 5 dollars for a nice big bag. And the other thing that 
I also love to get is the dragon fruit. Highly recommend dragon fruit. It's a good snack. It's healthier. And you got a couple of nice big ones in there. So dragon fruit is a good option as well. So obviously going to Costco, you get tempted to see a lot of these snacks. And in this case, the granola. And oh, it looks so good. And then what I do is I use a couple of different apps when I come. And you'd be surprised when you scan them. So I use the Bobby Approved app and also Yuka, and just to see the difference of the two. And you'll get disappointed when you scan them, but it certainly looks good. But I also think if you eat it in moderation, then maybe you can get away with enjoying a snack like that. So just food for thought there. So if you're looking for a snack, that they have that I could recommend that probably is healthier is that is it or that's it the strawberry mango and blueberry $13.99 definitely a good one to just put these small bars in your bag and you're having your car and uh, highly recommend well this finishes up my shopping I ended up buying five bags of these because they're on sale the Siete grain-free chips, the sea salt, which is so good. I think they were $4.99. I heard that Siete was selling out to Pepsi and hopefully it will end up staying the same as far as ingredients. I heard that and the agreement was that they would keep the ingredients the same and not change them. But I'm sure that could change, but stay tuned for that. In the meantime, they're still good, but great deal on the Siete chips and <laughs> there we are. Lots to snack on. Well, to wrap things up, I'm gonna have my Costco pizza. I don't normally get it, but today I'm in the mood. So thanks for joining me. We'll see you on the next trip to Costco.